हेलो व्यूअर्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई टी जे ओलम्पियाड्स एंड एपी फिजिक्स विद अम्बरीश सो टुडे आई हैव ब्रॉट अ प्रॉब्लम दैट फीचर्ड इन वन ऑफ आवर प्रैक्टिस टेस्ट्स ऑन मैग्नेटिक्स सो दैट द प्रॉब्लम इज अबाउट फाइंडिंग द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड एट द फोकस ऑफ एन एलिप्स सो हेयर द प्रॉब्लम वी हैव टू फाइंड द मैग्नेटिक फील्ड ड्यू टू करेंट आई फ्लोइंग इन एन एलिप्टिकल लूप एट इट्स फोकस सो दिस इज एन एलिप्टिकल लूप एंड द करेंट इज फ्लोइंग लाइक दिस एंड आई हैव टू फाइंड द फील्ड एट दिस पॉइंट ओके and the equation of the ellipse in polar coordinates is as shown uh, this this ellipse is shown and the equation is given as l by r is equal to 1 plus e cos theta okay here l is this and uh, you can say that this is semi latus rectum and this is the equation of the ellipse here e is the eccentricity which is a constant take l is equal to 50 cm e is equal to 0.8 and i is equal to 2 amperes and if your answer is n pi into 10 to the power minus 7 tesla fill n in the omr sheet okay so this is a problem and if you want you can uh, pause this video and try out this problem for some time and then uh, uh, you can look at my solution uh, for now i'll straight away get into the analysis of it so so <coughs> sometimes students feel overwhelmed with the ellipse and the equation but it turns out that once you start uh, making the calculations it's after all not that difficult a problem so it's uh, simply let's proceed so let's say i have uh, uh, some element of length dl let us say this is length i dl and this current element i'm calling as i dl okay and this is at an angle theta and the uh, angular width of this element is let us say d theta so what is the db at this point so we simply use the biot and savart law and what do we get db is equal to mu not by 4 pi i dl cross r upon r cube now what is i dl cross r if you see this is the i dl and this is your r vector and let us say this angle is phi so if this angle is phi then the this angle is going to be 180 minus phi and you know that sin of 180 minus phi is same as sin phi so so the, what does this simplify to so this becomes mu not i by 4 pi r cube and r and dl sin phi okay r cross uh, dl will be r into dl into sin phi okay and now what i have done i have uh, dropped a perpendicular from this point on the radius vector and then this becomes a right angle triangle and i know that this length which is also rd theta approximately this is rd theta if this is r this is also approximately r so this length can be thought of as rd theta uh, this highly exaggerated figure actually d theta is supposed to be uh, imagine it to be 10 to the power minus uh, 100 or something like that okay so very very small angle so if this is r this is also approximately r and this becomes simply rd theta because it's perpendicular over here so dl sin phi is rd theta okay so then uh, since dl sin phi is rd theta i can just straight away substitute that into this integral so i know r as a function of theta and i know then dl sin phi as of in terms of d theta so the whole integral will get transformed into theta okay and then i can always integrate it theta varying from 0 to 2 pi okay so that's what i have done uh, now it's just a matter of simple math so uh, so this becomes mu not i by 4 pi r cube this is as it is then r dl sin phi so r comes as it is and dl sin phi i have written as r d theta as i showed here this is r d theta and this is also dl sin phi okay so uh, okay and if you simplify this this becomes mu not i by 4 pi r into d theta now what is r so r is l upon 1 plus e cos theta that's given in the question so l by r is 1 plus e cos theta that means r is l upon 1 plus e cos theta so that's what i substituted now just put it over here and uh, you integrate this whole thing this is the db expression and db you need to integrate from 0 to 2 pi okay if you integrate this now then e cos theta integration becomes e sin theta and you are putting the limit 0 to 2 pi so uh, beautiful thing here is that uh, sin 2 pi is also 0 sin 0 is also 0 so e doesn't matter at all so uh, that data is uh, uh, not required at all and i could have as well uh, asked you to compare the fields due, uh, due to different ellipses uh, Uh, with different eccentricities okay so <coughs> with same l this uh, uh, the final b that i am getting this is independent of the eccentricity so that is mu not i by 2 2l and then i can just substitute the values i is 2 ampere l is 0.5 meter and uh, uh, then uh, i just put everything in here and mu not is of course 4 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 and i get 8 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 tesla and n is 8 okay so i hope you uh, like the solution of this problem and if you did 
uh, appreciate this problem please do give it a thumbs up and uh, please do share it with uh, your friends uh, or uh, you can say telegram groups or uh, whatsapp groups that you might be part of any study groups that you might be part of please do share my video with them and uh, uh, if you have not already subscribed please do please do subscribe to my channel uh, that's the only motivation i have when I, when i get good comments from you people when i get likes or when uh, uh, i get to hear nice th nice things about my channel that's what motivates me keeps driving me so please do keep coming to watch the videos on my channel i hope uh, you liked it and uh, all the best to